Hi guys, this video is a little bit different. I am trying something new with my channel. I wanted to start this little series called Little Talk where I'm gonna edit them like my normal video but they're super duper unplanned and it's just me existing and telling you what I'm thinking about and my thoughts on things so I'm sitting here right now in my tent and I've been looking at my YouTube channel just going through all of the different videos and stuff and looking and seeing how they're doing and they seem to be doing pretty good actually I really love doing YouTube it is one of my favorite things in the whole wide world it makes me so freaking happy to do and I love the kind of feedback I get especially Especially from you guys it's awesome and I've had a lot of really good ideas come to me today for the Adri channel which is super exciting and I think in a minute here I am gonna go grab my YouTube notebook so I can work on planning a couple of them because I'm feeling motivated enough to do that and I don't always feel motivated enough to do that if you know what I mean so I think that I'm gonna do that but I'm just sitting here and I'm just thinking about things and I searched up age regression on YouTube which is not something I do very often because it used to be when you search it up a lot of negative things would come up or a lot of videos that weren't about age regression would come up and that's a little bit frustrating when you're looking for specifically age content but I looked it up and I actually found a couple more channels to subscribe to and they look like they're active so We'll see, because I've noticed that a big problem with a lot of the age videos that are on YouTube right now is that people start and make a couple videos, and then they just drop off the face of the planet and never make another video again, which is super duper sad, because I feel like we could all use those good Adri videos and I know that there's really only one Adri YouTuber that I watch and that's baby Danielle I'll link her channel down below she is such a sweetheart and she's adorable but she's the only really other consistent Adri YouTuber I've really found besides myself and I don't really like watching my own videos when I regress. I like editing my videos when I regress, and I like filming my videos when I regress, but I am not a big fan of watching my own videos back when I regress. I think that would be a little bit too weird for me, but honestly, that's okay. I just wish more people would do Adri YouTube. It is so freaking fun and rewarding, and you really don't have to deal with judgment you are not obligated to have your likes or comments on I don't have them on my videos for safety reasons due to stuff that I've been through and that's totally okay and you know what I still get feedback because people will message me on Instagram or they'll tweet at me and they'll say hey I really like the new video because people who like your content will reach out to you even if they can't comment on the direct platform that they're using to view your content if that makes sense it's a little bit of a grown-up subject for us babies to understand but I feel like it also is kind of easier to understand if you've ever really done a social media platform like YouTube consistently and it's a little bit different than just posting whatever you want randomly on Instagram or Twitter it takes a little bit more preparation than that because you gotta edit, you gotta do the thumbnail, gotta do background music. There's a lot of stuff that goes with it. But it's super fun and it's really easy to learn. And another thing I have had on my mind is that people are unnecessarily mean. And I'm just going to take this minute to say it costs exactly zero dollars to be a kind person. Even if the person wasn't kind to you, even if they did something you didn't like, it costs no money to be kind and be nice and to not bully people, to not harass people. If someone's trying to move on from something in their life, don't 
come and continue to bring it up. And for the love of goodness, if somebody blocks you, don't message them on another account. Don't make another account to message them off of. Whether it's nice or not, or curious or not, there's probably a reason. And I'm just saying this because of an experience I had to deal with today. And I've been dealing with someone who has been not so nice that is has been enjoying coming into my messages and the comments on some social media of mine and being very rude and very mean about a past relationship. And I have been doing my very best for the past six or seven months to get over that and move on with my life. And yet this individual keeps bringing it up with me and it's not fun. So please don't do that to other people. I'm sure most of you are really, really good and really, really awesome. And you won't do that to anyone else, which is so cool. Big thumbs up because people who do that are poopy heads and we don't like poopy heads in this tent. But that's just what I've been thinking about. I have a feeling that all of these little talks videos are just going to be super short, sweet, and simple. And I am actually not filming this on my vlog camera or my main camera right now. I am just filming it on my phone because I was sitting here and I got the idea to do it. And it's super fun and I'm really liking it. So my friends, if you enjoyed this little talk with me, you can subscribe to this channel for more age regression content because I post a couple of times a week. You can also follow me over on Instagram, which is at crayons and pencils or over on Twitter, which is at crayon kiddo. I have a wish list and a Ko-Fi linked below if you would like to support my content. I really, really appreciate it. I love you guys so hecking much and I will see you soon. Goodbye.